Don't need no tummy tuck, breast lift to impress me. Girl, you don't need no tummy tuck, no breast lift to impress me. Girl, you don't need no tummy tuck, breast lift to impress me. So Damn. I can co sign that if you want. Fuck your shit. We holding grudges now? Oh, no, I don't have a grudge. I just want to let you know. Yo, what the hell did you take that you got that got you bugging? I was drinking. And what else? Drinking. You ate something though. I saw you earlier. You ate something. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Yo, welcome back and anything. Yo, another week. Um week three. Of uh, certainly random, we got uh, with us Jenan Shuffle. Look at this nigga. You think DJ? You think DJ? She wants to be somebody else. She yeah. go away she... for a week and come back somebody else. Yeah. Yeah. I have decided I'm going back. She... I'm. I have decided I'm going by my original name, and that is Jenan Jean-François. Thank you. And where are you from? Haiti! Haiti, Nick. Haiti! Shelly! That's what I say. Sac passe! Naboule. Naboule. Moi même qui dit, sac passe, ou même qui dit, naboule. Sac passe! You act like you're telling me not to say something. Well, that's because you're just listening. You have to hear me. Hey, we back. It's freezing, as you can see. Disturbingly random. Disturbingly random. Well, what's in, 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 in French. <laughs> this week. In French. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Hey, man, man, get your big ass shoulder. Thought of my video, my um, camera, though. Be careful with your big ass shoulder. And anything. Hey, we got, we got a lot of shit going on. It's a lot going on. A lot on. of shit going on. Anything. I wish we could do a yo, pan around. Hey, <laughs> yo, somewhere in this damn, in this damn yeah. room, we got, we got AG. Our, uh, AG, say yo, what's up, man? Just say what's up. Say what's up without laughing. And anything you got AG or anything, I'm saying like, yo, AG is like a, a prime member. And anything he used to be like, you know, what I'm saying like the first dude. He's a day one a one. Day one one. <laughs> and yeah, day, what's a day one? What's before day one? Um, zip. Nothing. Day zip. Nothing. Day never. This is like a day he before day, day one. one one. That was like yo back when it was like sweat. What was the sweat radio AG? Back up, AG. Lay, oh, lay, 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 lay back so you don't block my footage over there. Oh, lay back. Definitely. But what was it? Sweat radio. Sweat radio. Sweat mm -hmm. radio. That was the beginning of this thing, huh? Mm -hmm. Yo, that was like what? How many years ago? 12 years ago? Damn, dog. That was like 12 years. 14 years ago. 14 years ago. Back when nobody knew what podcast was going to be. We mm -hmm. knew. Yeah, we used to do them at a salon in Metuchen after hours. Damn, you know, tell me, that's actually where we met him. You love it. You love it. Hey, man. Yo, we got a lot to talk about this week, man. Yo, a lot happened. Goddamn, how was whack? Wow. I'm starting early. Here goes your shit. Wow. I'm so First of all, let's talk about that um very drab ass theme song. Trey songs. I'm gonna need you to do me a favor. Never again. So hold up, so you're saying Just baby. leave it alone. So you're saying Joe Joe is the one? Joe, what happened to you? I'm not in this. I hope you got your royalties they before they put Trey on the show. Why do you got the money over there? Because I'm kind of cold and I'm behind. You know what I did? I don't know. Oh, oh your knees out. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you got lipstick on this week. My lipstick is popping. Not, not lip gloss be popping. No, it's not. No, my daughter got all the lip gloss. I don't got all that. She has three bins full of lip glosses. I know One so of them is dedicated I, to just clear I know clear so because I dropped off at college today. Yeah, your damn daughter, man. Yo, that's too much shit to take to college. It was. Yo, I hate college kids. How did you guys make your list gonna, for the stuff that she needs to bring well, to college? Well, she sent me what well, she wanted me to get. Wasn't no list. Everything. Wasn't no list. Wasn't Do you? No okay, list. so there's this show that T-Pain has. I think it's on Vice, right? And he just interviewed these two guys who started this app that were in college that would buy your stuff for you when you're going to college so that you don't have to worry about it because everybody's also also Why the hell are you just telling me now? Well, I didn't see you last week, remember? You saw me the week before then. I didn't know about it then. Well, it's called communication. Ay, ay, ay. 
So now next year. Between two women. Well, well, next year she won't need it because she just bring she it. Gotta go she got to go back next year. Yeah, but then she already got it though. Take that same shit back. She ain't going to take that same shit back. She not. I promise you. Uh, damn it, I'm scared, man. What the hell just happened? Oh, anything, um, well, back to power with being whack. Wow, what's whack about it? No, no, Angela bit fun. the dust. Who saw that coming? I did. Yeah? Yeah, mm -hmm. I wish for it. And it you happened. Did? Yeah, I wish for it and it happened. That's wild. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's a fed. She's a fed. I, got, I wish for all feds. You know who I really would get killed hey. off? Who? Lala. Mm. She has serves zero purpose. Listen, nobody oh, on it. I like nobody on that line, show. Now. I line. like nobody on that show. Nobody. Okay. I used to like Tommy. I don't even like Tommy anymore. Why you don't like Tommy? Tommy's a sucker now. Lala no, has, but you have to understand. Take show, back. Right? No, Tommy uh -huh. has a lot of what? Yeah, do the. It's just a show, right? Well, that's Tariq, Tariq's a chump son. Tommy's a chump friend. Ghost is sucker. Um, Tasha and anything, she's whack as a, as a wife or a girlfriend or whatever she wanted to no, be. No, she's, she's whack, whack for letting those people board, put those wigs on her head. <laughs> Damn. Terrible. Right. Terrible. Um, I um, said it. 50's dead. Um. Is he really dead? Yeah, he's dead. No, he's in the morgue. He was cold and ashy. You know what I mean? It's just, it's just a lot of stuff that's whack about this show. The writing is terrible. I'm not doing power no more. I'm no, the power. writing for Lala is terrible. I'm, I'm not doing power. I asked no you next week. Did you say you're gonna say yes? I'm gonna watch it. So true. Well, I'm gonna tell you what power was like. Descri I'm gonna describe it. Go no, ahead. I'm gonna tell you what power was like. How is power is like a, a relationship that you invested five years into, and you're like, yo, I don't want to cut this loose because she just might get right. Cheating ass ex boyfriend, but he Damn, got a good I didn't job. Say, I didn't, yeah, yeah, okay. We'll do it. <laughs> All right, then. Fuck it. We'll that's it. what it's like. All right. Well, that's what it's like. But he's a good so provider. You, you get it. You get it then. You get it. So she's showing up, but it's like, yo, I'm not really sure if I really want to keep fucking with you. Nah. What? Were you here just now? Yeah. Oh. Where'd you just go? <laughs> All right, go ahead. Um. Can I just tell you? She got a job. Did you watch the MTV Awards? At least did you do that? Did you watch that? Yes, and my son was there. They were there. My Newark. son was there. Your son was in Newark. He's a hood. Why they keep it a secret that they hood. was doing it at Prudential? No. Did anybody else know? At the Rock. Yeah. They call it The Rock. The at, Rock. It is at The Rock. One of my white friends told me that. Boo. Because that's what Why I think. Why is Because is any us. other time, any other time the VMAs are coming up, mm -hmm. they're advertising for it. This year at the Lincoln Center VMAs, blah, Bro, they said it? shit it about there. Prudential or Asbury Park, Jonas Brothers. Damn, because it was in Newark. What's that supposed to mean? What's that mean? They ain't really getting a shot. It's supposed to I have clients that work in law enforcement in in Newark, and they said that they do clean really? that oh, shit oh, up oh, oh, nicely oh, for the VMAs. Oh, do you really? I sure do. Fucks with me. Damn. You gonna get me a sticker or a joint for the window? Cause I gotta give me one for me first. <laughs> get your friend. Tell your friends to act up. Tell your friends to act up. It's hey, not Christmas season yet. Something. Watch. Once yeah. the holiday season Yo, comes. Hold on, time. Wait. Did you hear this? Did you hear this? What you got? What you got? Tell me tell what you got. Me Say what, what you got you again. Say what you got. Tell me. I got the handicap. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm -hmm. You got the handicap sticker. How you get that? I'm handicapped. Uh, why? Why you can't? Why you handicapped? Why you handicapped? Tell me why you handicapped. Tell me why you handicapped. Why you That's handicapped? not a nice word to say. Do it. Tell, tell me why. Tell me why. Tell me why. Tell me why. I got some issues, man. Listen. You don't want to tell her? You don't want to tell her? Tell us. It's all why. It's too much going on with these hot flashes. <laughs> all right, nigga. <laughs> Yo, Missy Elliott killed him. Yo, you know who killed Missy it? Missy Elliott killed that. Let killed me tell you who TV killed awards. it. Let me tell you who killed it. That blow up of that ass that Lizzo had behind her twerking. I seen that, that shit. She killed it. Was killing it. I she had a blow up wait, like of yeah. a fat ass, Lizzo, and it was twerking. But do, do people like Lizzo just because she's fat? And well, they don't wanna. I don't like that. That you said that. Oh, knock it off. She's fat. Oh, wait, wait, let me stop. Let me stop. She has stop, a positive stop. body stop, image. Stop right now. Stop right Why? now. Why? You stop. You're not fat. You're skinny. Yeah, you're just stop it. For real, for real. Do me a favor. Um, please stop acting like Lizzo ain't fat. She's fat. All right. You can say what it is. You know what I'm saying? If she's fat, she's fat. 
But that's not nice, is what I'm telling you. We, we can, we can, we next can, conversation. Yo, you don't think she looked like a laundry bag? Lizzo. No, you don't think so? Nah. Don't. You didn't watch the VMAs clearly. I did. <laughs> Alright, All right. whatever. Let me get back to my notes. <laughs> Yo, y'all. Yo, so, yo, Nipsey Hustle and anything, just so you know, Puma, they, they did do a good thing by Nipsey Hustle. And anything, I had to like curb this back into something positive. Because y'all was getting real negative. Yes, like, you was you getting are. real negative. No. <laughs> Why get a nose flare up? Because. Yeah, all right, but yo. What did Nipsey um, do? Puma? Them, them people, them, them Puma people, they said that everything that goes, that Nipsey does is, um, you know, there's no money going to like Puma. It's going to his family and to, you know, whatever. Well, so, thank you, Puma. not making no money off Also, oh, whoever awesome. bought Puma. Uh, Nipsey Hussle online. <clears throat> Nipsey Hussle awesome. Online. Good job, Puma. Hey, Nike, take notes. Damn, you beefing with Nike? No, I'm just saying. Just like, more corporations too. like that need no to doubt. do things like that to, you know, honor people who were for the community. Hey, man, uh, you, you man. were trying to big up Nork a little while ago because, like, you said, you, you, that's your folks? Nork, that's your folks? Yeah, from Nork. So, um, what you, what you got to say about that 120 million that they infused into Nork and anything? up that water crisis you, did you get water when you when, did you like get like any cases of water no i don't live in north uh -oh. but you from north was, how you feel about that north crisis that that water crisis it didn't happen. They need to she fix said it, it shouldn't happen no but everybody believe that i'm just saying they need to fix it like how they put 120 million into like okay we'll time. start getting these pipes up like, what they got? Get them pipes up, huh? <laughs> That's what you want to do? Get them pipes up? They need new pipes. That's a relationship. But what Get actually is, the, what actually are the steps to getting that cleaned up, though? Mm -hmm. What is the thing? You they, should know. They got, they got to revamp. They got to, like, tear all of the pipes, that's, all of the lead pipes inside of it and put some PVC. What's PVC? All right. How much is that going to cost the city? Don't care. 120 million. Let's start there. Okay, great. So Answer the done. question. What's PVC? It's sort of like plaster. Okay. So, so oh, that's what pipes. is outside. But PVC pipes and everything is what they doing like a lot of houses in now so that they don't the pipes don't rust. Mm -hmm. The same thing you do in houses you gotta do with the whole infrastructure new. You gotta redo it. Yeah, that's something they gotta do. They do. But would you have to displace it? Should, a a lot of money should have came that. in. The VMAs was down there. I mean, yeah, that's the whole point. Yeah, but that was like it. one air but whatever. Why they were down there and anything going through all of the, you know what I'm saying, like bringing in all these celebrities and whatever like that, they should have been focused on that. Yeah, but I guess no, this was no, already no, right? planned before the, the... Before what? Before they knew that there was a problem? No. Say that. Say no. that. What, say, 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 say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. Say it. I want you to say it. No. Oh, okay. You can't make me say what I don't want to say. There's Cookie. There she is. That's what I want you to be, right there. I knew I could pull your string. There you go. Goddamn no. <laughs> Damn no. <laughs> Now would you like, giggling like that? Yo, so um, what you think is like the best thing that we, you know, maybe maybe if we like, you know, to have Kanye come down here and have a church service, and they, maybe we could like kind of raise some money and they think, maybe more than hundred twenty million. You know what? Do you buy into that Kanye shit? You make me tired. Oh, why? <laughs> you, you buy, do you buy into Kanye shit? Do I buy into Kanye shit? Yeah, the whole church service that he'd be doing. The Sunday service. The Sunday service. I think that that's something Kanye does to make him feel like he's home in a place where he feels like an outsider. Kanye, Kanye feels shit. Maybe. Flat out. Kanye feels Maybe. shit. Why you say that? That, that, he, that <coughs> motherfucker just lost, man. He just, he just, I don't even think he feels nothing. I think he just shit. bought into what his scene was. He's just like, alright, fuck it, I'm gonna just do it. That ain't a scene, that's just... You know, the only people that's not going to fucking kick you in your ass and anything is the church. You know what I mean? Like when, when what's the boy name? What's the, um, what's the church boy name, man? A AG, what's that church boy name and anything, um, who was doing, um, who had the show on BET and they, they was like, uh, it was like, um, American. Oh, Island. the really skinny one and he had glasses. The boy had, uh, Donnie McClurk, Donnie McClurkin? What's his name? What's his name, right? Yeah, right, what's his name? Roger. I forget the dude's name, but anyway, he had a... It's called Google. Let's Google and see. 
No, I ain't. We'll Google it. You got a damn phone? Huh. Hey, but Donnie McClurkin, I think it was. He had a show. Donnie McClurkin, he had a show on BET. Sunday's best. Sunday's best. Sunday's best. And nobody would. And it's like you said. Who you said? Sunday's best. Donnie McClurkin. That's his name? Donnie McClurkin was Kirk wasn't on. Wasn't it Kirk Franklin that did that? No, 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 no. Yeah. Sunday's right. best. Let's see. Anyway, and whoever it was, talk, let me know what I'm, where, I'm, where I'm wrong at. Why did that? Bikini girls, if I'm talking about Donnie. I was trying to What's show the comparison doing? between Lala's new body and her old body, and that shit is not the same. Kirk Franklin. Just Kirk saying. Didn't I just say that? But when they got oh, like. Look, dude, look, dude. I don't know what I was talking about. Kirk. Four, seven? Out. Four, seven. <laughs> Four, seven. <laughs> with, with ten points. <laughs> shorter than who? Prince. But he's shorter than Prince. No, yeah, he's he a did. little guy. You know who else is a little guy? Missy Elliott. She's a tiny, wait, wait, tiny, wait, wait, wait. tiny little guy. Tiny little Why do you keep saying a little guy? Isn't guy? she a girl? I meant like little guy, like you know how. Would you be bug? Would you bug if you saw Kurt Franklin with his cheeks out? <laughs> like if you had pants with cheeks out. My chaps. Your chaps. <laughs> would it bug you? First of all, where would Kurt Franklin be in chaps? And like why the hell would he be there? I don't want to be at a place anywhere. No, nah, it would bug you up. If he had his hair wrapped up with chaps. AG said if he had his hair wrapped up with chaps. Yo, hold up for a second. Six Is manscaping salt. bugged out for y'all or something? That's why you bugging? Who? Manscaping? manscaping. Man, man, better be Where? Don't Do you need an icebreaker? What's that, baby? Cookie? He's trying to get to something. He asked this question. I'm paying attention. What? I'm saying, would you, if a man ever do, like, if a dude, like, had got a Brazilian... I know what you're getting at. You're trying to get... I'm trying to get at it right now. No, no, go ahead. Would it bother you if a man, though? Would it bother you if a man, um, man, if he, um... If he uh, had a, got a Brazilian wax, I want to know. No, I like a manscape. Well, I don't want no hair. Down. Say word. You a like man to, to get a Brazilian off? wax. Yeah, Brazilian wax. Talk about it. Yeah. Would you? Yeah. That's out? that's Would it different. You? you said you want. I mean, if, it, if you want to endure that pain, go right ahead. I just don't understand why. No, don't worry about his pain. Would you like it? Would I like it if he came home and said, "Hey, baby, I just got an, I got a wax he ain't today." Gonna you, he ain't gonna tell you. You gonna find out though. No, I'm gonna see it. I'm gonna see that. I should hope he shaved. <laughs> no, if he got a Brazilian vaccinated. I don't know. Out. I, I just would want you, you to be one? like a man. You will go get one? Sure. I'm, I've been trying to see if I can find it. Oh, I, I, nah, I'm gonna take you where I go. Where? I'm gonna tell Where you I'm go? Lunchbox? Do you go to Lunchbox? What the hell? Say it again. Lunchbox oh. is a wax place. Lunchbox. It is. Get the Lunchbox. Huh? It is. Lunchbox is a place in Morristown, and it's a wax place where you here go. Here I am, here I, and here I am trying to pop some rosé for my birthday. That's right. And, and that you, that you happy, birthday birthday happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. All right, knock it off. Happy right. birthday. Do the show. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba. 
give me a bit. I'm going for your shots about cookie dough. Shot, shot, no, shot, no, no, tell shot, 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 that's some rude shit. It and I ain't talking shit. about it now. Why? Because I'm so, aggravated. Suit yourself. So I'll talk about it when I want to talk about okay, it. Okay, we go. Um, <laughs> okay, well, let me get You know what you need to do next year for your shots by cookie? Get it's down to Afro Punk so you could sell them in the little. Hey, that's where you was at. That's, that's why you, you should have told us about it. You want to talk about it, but well, you, you ain't telling nobody about it. Do you think that's why did you. And when you ain't show up last week and everything for Afro, so you go to Afro Punk and you ain't come to the um, podcast? Wait, what day was it on? Saturday. So and we stayed on like Sunday, so why you can't come Sunday? Shut up and okay. listen, you missing it. Huh? She went Saturday, but I'm trying to figure out why she couldn't come on she Sunday. She didn't recover, she was drunk. First of all, I was working on Sunday and couldn't make it. That's why I wasn't here. It was, had nothing to do. This is work. This your job. You worked till 7 o'clock at night? Job. Last Sunday I did. Anyway. What was your I had doing? clients after work. So after coming, so coming was the gym. You gonna go next year? Mm-hmm. You should. You should go. You absolutely mm-hmm. should. Yo. Then so. I got my tummy tuck. Miss Cookie, you know so. that there is a certain so. person so. who does not want you to get a tummy tuck. You don't need that have. to impress him. I need my tummy tuck. <laughs> my breast Yes, I do. On that weekend. <laughs> On a weekend. Just a crazy. Yeah, man. Yo, you're kidding. Well, you just wait. Yo, you listen, man. Wait. You just wait. Hey, Coming to America 2 is coming out, right? I wish I could play in it. No, you don't. Wow. You well, know what? Oh, that my was, God. That... I, could be, I could be Eddie Murphy's wife. I got this from Afro Punk. Back now. I should keep talking about Afropunk. Why? You never even went. I know, but you went. You went. It's your first time going? It's my first time. And you told me you went. Wait, no, but tell me what happened. Afropunk. Tell me what happened. What happened? So, I just love the collection of black people that are there and in the looks and serving looks and celebrating their blackness and loving it. They have different vendors. I met this woman who makes customized shoes with African gone and African um, style you took uh, a picture? Uh, did fabrics. Have, did you take pictures and stuff? Of course. Actually, the there was a bunch of party. photographers there, obviously, mm-hmm. and I got stopped by somebody um, and he put me up on his Instagram. <laughs> I'm obviously a celebrity. Hey, man. Hey, man. That's what's up. Yeah. That's what's up. I know that's right. They have three different stages. The main stage and then the other stage that's closest to where the food vendors are. And then they have one stage that's dedicated to rock. Mm -hmm. Very cool. That's what's up. Very cool. Two days. It used to be free. And then everybody heard about it. And now $70 is at the Commodore Park in in Brooklyn. Has so much fun. Of course it's in Brooklyn. So many looks. It's Afro stuff. (laughs) Gotta do it. A lot of um Afro punk hashtag Afro. A lot, lot of um, lot of uh. What you say? Say it. Talking about X Clan. X. Did you see any X Clan people there? AJ, what the? Fuck? Yo, X Clan. Shame, you know who X Clan is. Why you whispering? Right centric, right? Man. You can talk. She don't know. We're gonna talk. I'm the I'm the director. It's okay. You can talk. You know what? They don't Yo. care. Explain. All the Afrocentric stuff happens in Brooklyn. It's Medina. It's true. True. Yo. Hey. It's Medina. Do you did you hear did you hear from like did you hear from Brother J? Professor X. Professor X. No. Sugar Shack. No. Paradise the Architect. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Did you, did you see a pink Cadillac riding through? No. With the with the key, sissy. Did you hear? Did you hear? Did you see him? I'm talking that? about a movie. No. It's going Damn. over my head. It's I'm been over here. mine. They so crazy. I'm sorry. All right, I got some stuff on, on my um on my checklist here. I need to actually yeah. some stuff for that. Why don't you run down that list, bro? All right, I'm gonna like. I'm just gonna touch upon it. Hey, public displays of affection. Like holding hands and kissing and stuff like that. Or sex. Um, in public. 
Right. Sex in a public space. And what do you willing, well, like? How far are you willing to go? What would you do? See, sex in a public split place and public displays of affection is two different things. All right, let's go. With the, let's go with the furthest thing. Sex in a public place. What? Tell me what you're willing to do. What's the furthest you're willing to go? I will have sex in a public place. Oh, you want to go far? I will do that. I could. I would do that. Like how? You haven't done it. Have you I done? haven't. I have. have. I'm asking you. Like what did? You, where, where was your, Where was the place? Um, in the bathroom of a restaurant. Oh, not outside though. <laughs> like in the open, like a porno. No, like outside the parking lot, outside um, the park, or outside. Um, I've done it outside. Where, where was that at? In a jacuzzi. That's my oh, like a location. Like you was. That's my that house. house. So, damn, a jacuzzi. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>
They what? sold out of the crates that they got for that AG week Lee. on Monday. Reordered, they came in on Tuesday. 14 crates on Tuesday sold out on Tuesday. Do you think somebody would have hijacked that, uh, that, that truck with the uh, chicken patties on it? Do you think it would have been over? And then just started selling them on, on their the block, IG plate? The block, yeah. <laughs> hey, yo, we got them chicken patties from Popeyes. Come get them three for eight. I like chicken patties. <laughs> three for eight. <laughs> did, you, did you get a chance to taste them? Nah. Did you, did you? I went. They sold out, so I got a 12 piece instead. Yo, I didn't taste that. I didn't. I got a 12 piece tender. My I was already there. I had to get done. But they don't, have, they don't come with cheese. I like cheese on my chicken. A crispy chicken sandwich. This is the thing. The comparison between the Chick-fil-A and the Popeyes. Listen, Chick-fil-A is always going to give you consistency. I feel like who's Popeyes the, and Dunkin' go together and Chick-fil-A and Starbucks go together. What? Say that to me again. Why? <laughs> why? Tell me why. Tell me why. Tell me why. Because I feel like Chick-fil-A and Starbucks are classy. And then Popeyes and who else? Then you know that. So, what you're saying? So, no, no, no. So what, you, so what you're saying is, is that Chick Fil A is to Starbucks as Popeyes is to Dunkin'. Okay. Oh. And then that's it. Take that and you and go. 
No, I ain't even gonna get there. Once I say I'm good. So he gotta leave. Or do you just like still? So home? is the actual question? You gotta leave. Question, where we gonna be at? Is the me actual and my question? Y'all about to get it popping? And he pull out the magnum and anything. He like, oh, you know what I mean? And anything I'm saying, then you like, this your nine. I don't know what you mean. I and think the actual leave. question here is, is does size matter? I'm gonna get to that. So does it? It depends. On what? How big it is. <laughs> I mean, if it's enormous. I can't do anything with that. Mm-hmm. I'm a tiny little woman. Mm-hmm. You know? This a tiny little I don't want to. I don't want to. have more than one hole, though. Oh, wow. I'm sorry. Right. Mm-hmm. Get, 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 no, no, no. Don't just say. What the hell at me? What the hell at me? That more than one hole? But if it's too big this, to this is coming what? from This is coming from a woman who said a few minutes ago and everything that she ain't want to she ain't want to say the places that she uh, was if saying. If it's too big to fit in one, mm-hmm. then it obviously can't go in the other one. Mm-hmm. So, it's, then what's it's the third not. Half? He go home. Or how? So where you where you send him? You can unhinge your. You send him to. He ain't. Once I see it, it ain't right. <laughs> it ain't nothing to talk about. I'm. I can leave. But y'all are not really giving to y'all are not really getting to the bottom of it. So when you say size matters and anything, you're saying like size. You going to I feel like that question. That, what I'm the question to, I'm, was. I'm starting off with if a dude shows up and anything, I'm saying, yo, and he got like a magnum, but he don't fit a magnum and anything, where do you send him? Do you just keep him or you to send the him store home? to get the one right that fit? So, yeah. Yeah, so you do, you keep him in, you keep him anyway, just tell him to go to the store and get something that fit. Well, yeah, this don't go that way. All right, that was bad. Uh, I'm was just bad. saying. That's honest. What do you do? You you said you do it. It's gonna fit. If you gonna if it's going down, go get some that fit. Go get, get some that fit. Hurry back. Hurry back. Hurry back. And and just like circulation off. <laughs> that's a big ring. Mmm. They don't. They don't. They not that tight. The what? Yeah. They're to cut up all the circulation, Nathan, so you keep the blood. Yeah, down. but it don't be that tight though. It's supposed to. Oof. You want to stop breathing? Who cares? That's not your problem. What the fuck you mean? It won't be my problem. A dead man in my bed? No, no, no. I'm going to hold that. They like, he ain't going to die. Uh, he ain't going to die. Yeah, yeah. He got a tight joint around his joint. Oh, just blood just stays there. You did it before? Probably I did. What's, why are you always so secretive? Probably. You don't have a problem asking us questions. So when we ask you questions, answer it. Yeah, it's straight like that. Yeah, I did. Damn. Yeah, I did. All right, then. I would do it. You got the love bees, too? Oh, well, let's talk about bullets. First chapter of my book, my first book. Let's talk about that. Because I talked about that. I'm published. I'm there. I don't are have you, a book. Are, are you published? And anything about what you do? Because I'm published. I don't have a I book. I tell you. Read the book. You don't know exactly what I did. Okay. Yeah. 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 I'm asking you like you asked nah, read question. the book. Read the book. I don't know what to read the book. <laughs> <laughs> Put it on audio. Let me listen to it. Yeah, well, I guess you solved solve that problem. Yeah. yeah. See? Yeah. Uh, looking for a sponsorship shit. from Audible. Hit us up shit. in the DMs. Talking your shit. Yeah. Right, yeah, so, um, some more stuff from my list. Hey, milk me. Milk me. Look, you milk always talk about some more. emails. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Meek Mill, Meek Mill is free for probation. Yeah, man. Awesome. Are you very happy? Yeah. Sure. And anything, yeah. I like Meek Mill. Yeah, right. I like his new, uh, new found meat milk. I'm just going to say, you're looking at that camera. Back, I love how his son looked at him and was like, hey, I want you to be married. Oh, he said that? Yeah. Oh. He said it on camera. It was so cute. It was around the holidays. And somebody was interviewing, like, like, they were passing by and, like, on some oh, uh, I wanted to talk about uh, Rick Ross. <laughs> Rick Ross. Why do you look like that? You tired? Rick Ross, um, Rick Ross dropped his, uh, he dropped, he dropped the album and he did his book called Hurricane. And he was, uh, touching up on, um, up on, like, he had some, uh, drug dealings in different states or whatever like that. You believe that shit? Do I believe that Rick Ross was a drug dealer? Yeah. Yeah, Rick I believe it. Rick Ross get the fuck out of here. Because he wasn't. And you know that for a fact. I don't give a fuck. Oh. Are you going to explain? So what the hell you talking I was about? a drug dealer. Yeah. You're not going to goddamn tell me what the hell you was doing in ATM saying if I know what it is to be one. Okay. Anything. Rick Ross, if it took you that goddamn long to talk about what you was doing, 
Oh, I mean, put my all shirt down for this. Yeah, put your shirt down. If it took you all this time to talk about what you was doing, and you had all the platforms in the goddamn world to talk about being a drug dealer, and then now you pop up and say, Yo, yeah, I was in this state, and I was in that Charlemagne, I was in your state too, I was getting money in your state, in your town too. Why didn't you say that a long time ago? Your, sto your, your story sounds kind of fugazi. Amazing to me. You know what I mean? But it's was like, that something that went with... Yeah, his, his career, yes. It did. It did. Uh, Why does it matter when you talk about it to when you don't? It does. Why? Because Rick Ross was selling that off to everybody a long time ago. Now you're just telling the story about so it. So now he's just, he now, was now portraying he's to portraying be such. But to be in such. But, but it now wasn't he, true. But he was never telling this story. Now all of a sudden you tell the story. Why? Because statute of limitations. There is none. There's nothing for that. You could have, that was that been over. Rick Ross, but his career was 15 years old. Mm -hmm. You could have been told that story. Well, he's making cameos on TV. On, of course um, he is. On TV shows. And so, my point is this. Made for movie TVs. Of course. My, my point is, my point is this. Movies. I think that a lot of, I think that a lot of artists, um, they kind of, they, they kind of take the, uh, the consumer stupidity and they, they or uh, their naivety. And they run with it, and they try to make themselves out to be something more than what they truly are. Like the whole marketing scheme now, they think is yeah. kind of is is way out there somewhere else, and they think where you know. Um, I think they they they. Why are you getting quiet? Because I'm listening. Oh, damn. You, better, you better goddamn say something about this too. Don't just sit there and say nothing. I think that they take tell me what to say. I just told, we just had the discussion, and you still gonna tell me what I better say? Don't tell me what I better say, cause if I don't wanna say nothing, I ain't gonna say nothing. You ain't gonna make me say it. I think that they take um what I was saying is I think that they they take, <laughs> they take the stupidity of the consumers or the ignorance of the consumers, and they run wild with it and anything, and they start just saying like, yo, you know what? Since you already. You already put me on a pedestal as, a, as an artist. As this, as I'm an artist, to... I'm just going to feed you whatever, and, they, and I know that you're going to believe it, or whatever. I don't like that. I don't like when they do that. Then you don't like a lot of people. I don't like a lot of people. You don't even like yourself. Oh. Why? I don't do that. I don't do that. Just, everything, I don't care. everything that I've, I've ever sold and everything to the, you know, to the public and everything has been truly me. I don't sell nothing that's not me. Everything that I've ever sold, every every last book that I've written and everything has been truly me. Say it again, AJ. Including Fork Spoon and Shank. And including Sp Fork Spoon and Shank. I, I wrote a cookbook. And you know what I'm saying? And every Say story, Say Fork Spoon and Shank. <laughs> and, and I wrote a cookbook, Fork Spoon and Shank, and everything in there and everything is true. My autobiography and everything, everything in there was true. Every story. Everything in there is true. You know what I'm saying? I wrote a book, uh, Ladies, I Know Why You're Single. Everything in there was true because I wrote it about you. My who? Not you. One, probably a chapter in there was about you. And anything, but it was about... So I'm supposed to get some royalty. Mm -hmm. No. I didn't say your name. You just told me it was about me. Oh, well. You should figure it out. It was a character based off of cookies. <coughs> but everything in there was true. You know what I mean? I didn't wait till later on in anything and try to, you know what I'm saying, portray some image in anything that was... That, say, if I say everything, why you ain't hitting me? If I keep saying and everything, how come you don't hit me? You want to start this up again? You know that I don't like when I say it. Okay, so say it again. I'm not going to say it again. Because I was going to smack backhand and shit out you. What? And everything, because I say and everything. Because I keep saying it. But I just don't like it. filler. I know, I don't, I don't like it. Oh, okay. But, you know, you what, said I, too much. what I was saying is like, I don't like when, I don't like that artist... Or, or entertainers, they, they, I don't even like when entertainers, like, do podcasts, to be honest with you. I don't like it. But that's just a different realm for them to get more viewers but do you to not what believe, they're do you, doing. Do you not understand anything? Do you know about the hell one? I like that T.I. has one. I won't lie. I like that Joe Budden has one. Certain I'm people, certain people, podcast. they have a lot to say. <laughs> I would listen to T.I. Certain people that have a lot to say. Smart. Smart. Would I believe that? Edge, whoa, whoa. Edge and Mud Kids. Um, I like that certain people who, who already have a lot to say, if they got a platform to speak more than anything, then cool. Um, but for the most part, anything, I think that, and you hit me again, 90, 99% of the people that do podcasts who are already entertainers, I think that they get an hour away. Oh. Tell me. If they already have music, 
as as the outreach as their outreach or as their place to kind of you know what I'm saying um, project their talents to or whatever like that. And I look back at twelve years ago when I was first started doing podcasting, and then now you got artists trying to get into podcasting, whatever like that. Who do you think that the consumers are going to listen to first? Or to listen to the artists? They, they listen to the artists. They don't listen to the people who. Who they know? Exactly. So who's who's going to get bumped out of the way? Us. Us. The people in the. Well, that's because them. it's a it's Those a thing formats. that's overly saturated now. Now it is. And they think, so I think that artists should stick to what they do and let us have what we do. I don't know. Because, I mean, we, so we can stick to what we do, but we still dive into other realms. If we can do it, Everybody just because they're so a celebrity doesn't mean that they don't they have does. the luxury to do so. Why? So, so, what happens when, so what happens when artists, when people, when the, the listeners don't listen to our podcast right now, but they listen to an artist podcast instead? What happens then? You don't have ratings. That's and my nobody point. Listens. But nobody listens mm-hmm. because they listen to the artists because they're attached to the artists. Mm-hmm. So then, what's the purpose of people like us doing podcasts? Yeah, but like if you podcast? market well and you build a following and you because work your avenue, avenue, your yeah, day avenue day is day different out, from everybody else. But, but it doesn't matter because really you will never, you'll never, you'll never win against an artist and anything who has the resources. Yeah, you're right. Because right. I mean, the more... resources are definitely more accessible to them, but that doesn't mean that we can't have those same resources. We just have to work a little bit harder at it. Now, that. if you have more time to be able to do that full time, then work at it and do your thing. Like. There's people who are no names who were no names last year and now this year that's all we can hear about and they weren't celebrities name last one. year. Name Fucking one. what's her name? La la blah 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 from um from um La la blah blah blah. What is her name? Her her Instagram is La La. She's funny as hell. Oh, oh the girl from Atlanta from Boomerang. Yes. Ring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But she's and on she, TV. She's two on TV. years ago you didn't even know her. She's on TV. She was just you know, somebody making memes on fucking Instagram and now all of a sudden she's a huge thing. Having you know That's gonna be like she's me. got she's got, you I know you acting yeah, the move. gigs, yeah, yeah, the move. all the things. She's doing She's on TV. The best. She's on TV already. She's awesome. Yeah, she's like so her. funny. I like her. She's uh, so funny. Yeah, she's fine, I like her. Um, and her best friend. Who? Cool. I don't know nobody's name, but I follow everyone. Um, blame something. But you He's gotta, the one who does T T T. You gotta you gotta take you gotta take people away take take away from the people who Yeah, are the girls time. from horrible decisions are doing exception, the thing. They were both rule. they're they how? Because that that's one person. That's one group. One duo. One duo. There's not many. There's not many. That's what I'm saying. It's like what I'm what I'm trying to the point that I'm trying to prove is that artists like let's say, let me ask you something. If Joe wasn't Joe Budden, and I like his podcast, if Joe wasn't Joe Budden, do you think that his podcast would be big? Maybe. If Joe Rogan wasn't Joe Rogan, do you think do you think his podcast would be big? Yeah, but the thing is, is they have a lot of interesting things to say. Don't you? Yeah. All right, that's my point. So why the hell should everybody listen to them instead of listening to you? I want to have more. Because you want to tell me this. that. Cause, but I, I know because you. At the end of the day, you're gonna say because they're celebrities and anything. And that's why I think that celebrities should yo, mind their celebrity as business. <laughs> that's my problem. That's my thing. Because we've been doing this for fucking too long, and anything for them to come in and all of a sudden take the limelight. That's my point. It, uh, this yeah. ain't yours. You can do music. But it you doesn't do belong movies. to just you one. Do, it doesn't belong. But I'm just saying. Podcasting and anything was formulated and anything for people who didn't have a voice to have a voice. You motherfuckers had a voice. Stay there. You know what I mean? Only reason why I accept and respect Joe Budden is because he's retired. He's a retired rapper. So now it's your turn to make him have a voice in another realm. That's why I'm like this, yo, you know what? He has a good podcast and he should be there. Other people, I'm like this, yo, stay your ass in your lane. This is ours. I'm willing to fight that fight. That's just me. That's just me. I say that I, I will put that out there. And AG know how I feel about that shit. Cookie, what do you feel? I don't know. Because I don't know, I don't know like, if I can go ahead and rebuttal. Because I don't... I, don't I mean, know. I get your like, point. But like... Yeah, but I mean, if you work hard enough at it, just fucking do they it. They don't got to work hard. 
They don't have to I'm go not saying that they do. I'm saying, like, I think the opportunity. They're like, it's gonna stamp their name. They it's just like if I go for a movie role. Yeah, who gonna get the role and anything? It's gonna be. They get the role before, before I get you it do. because they're not even trying to give me a chance because Vin is the. He's a celebrity. Let's say like the, get let, let's say let's say like. How do you know they wouldn't give you a chance you, just based off? Of you they're gonna give me a let's chance. Let's say you're trying to get into acting. Let's say you're trying to get into acting. You go. You see somebody who's doing a, um, a web series. You show up to the web series and you like this. Yo, I'm gonna get the role and anything. You know, um, because um, they shoot anything from around my way. Somebody shoot right around your way and you go there. And you like, I'm gonna pull up and anything. I could do the role and everything. I could be here every day early and whatever like that. And you show up, and then somebody, somebody who's been in acting, they've been in movies, they are B list, A list actor, actress and anything, and they show up and anything, and you like, and they get the role. You like, damn, why did I pick her? And they're like, yo, because she's a B list or A list actress. And they're like, they're not giving but me a chance, so I you're not giving me a chance. Or whatever like that. Of course she's going to get the role. Because she's of her credentials known, that she, mm-hmm. she's known. It's like, this. of course you're going to look to her. You know what I mean? So you pretty much want to tell her to mind your motherfucking be less A-less act ass. You know, business. Get your ass out of here. This is not for you. You know what I'm saying? It's like the web series game is for me. For me to come up. Podcasting is for us to come up. You know what I mean? Get your ass out the way. You know what I mean? So, it's like, when I start seeing, like... But you just... I'm saying, because you just said you're, you're listening to T.I. I like T.I. I, I, and I'll listen to him. And anything, right? And it's like, I really want to hate that T.I. is doing a podcast. It's just I uh, enjoy what T.I. say. I enjoy him saying some shit or something like that because it makes me laugh. Because he always trying to be, like, real... You know, he uses big words and it's funny to me. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, the, but the root... The root of me... The root of it all... I don't really want to see him doing a podcast. Because I'm like, unless he say... Tell me that he's going to... Retire, he's not gonna do rap no more. I'm all for it. But half of me is saying like this, yo, for real, T.I.? Come on, fam. You know what I mean? Yo, you, you know people are gonna listen to your shit. So now that means that any attention that anybody like us would get is going to T.I.'s podcast. So now you gotta start being like extra, you know what I'm saying? You gotta be extra smart about your marketing, extra p- smart about how you, you know what I'm saying, promote your shit or whatever like that. So it's like, let's say T.I. come out on a, on a Wednesday. Um, Joe come out on a Tuesday. Um, 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 your girl Lala come out on Thursday. We gotta find a day outside of that just to come out on so that we ain't fighting with their ratings. So that's why we're coming out on Sunday. So now we gotta come out, we view, we, we might film on a Sunday, but we gotta drop on a day that's not Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Joe dropped two days a week. He dropped, you know what I'm saying, Wednesday and Friday. Where does that leave us? Isn't there a way that you can, like monitor like algorithms and so like let's say if you were to drop on the same time as him you'll come up at the same frequency and then you can get as many hits i mean there's a there's a way to pull it there's a way to do it um you know what i mean um the, to, to manipulate algorithms or whatever like that you know um i can tell you off air but it's just it's just whack that you gotta play that game and anything with people who, need, who already got the built-in cheat code and the cheat code is that their celebrity is going to pull the viewers faster than yeah. it's going to pull that. I mean, I don't think that we should be like, oh, fuck you. You're, no, no, you're a celebrity. No, that's podcast. That's no, podcast no, 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 no. Podcasts are something that are super popular right now. No. So everybody's going to get into it, whether you're T.I. or Jinan jean mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. it is a well, thing Ms. that's Cookie. going to be, or Miss mm-hmm. Cookie, or, you know, raw. But my thing is, is like, if we're seeing it so that we can outreach then they're doing it too because they they know that they're going to reach just as many people, if not more, because of who the name is, you know? I mean, I I, I hear you. You know what I'm saying? I still still stand. I still... What you saying, AG? AG about to say something great. Sit back. Sit back. Alright. Here's the thing, right? Sure, everybody with name recognition has a leg up. Mm -hmm. But just because somebody has a name that people recognize doesn't mean that they have something to say that resonates with everybody. Mm-hmm. You know, fair enough. Adam Carolla, Joe Rogan, people like that, they have a high viewage rating because of their name and who they have on and what they have to say to those right, people. It's also the guests right? That they have on too. But at the same time, you still have people that have solely come up through the medium of you know, having their own voice, like like a TJ Sotomayor or, or some, you know what I'm saying, somebody like that who have 
gotten popular for their point of view. You know what I'm saying? So, not to say that, um, you know what I'm saying, Joe Rogan has nothing to say or nothing to offer. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, we have something to offer too. Or anybody that has their own specific opinion who's not just parroting or reiterating something that some that uh the news said or this uh trending person said somebody that has a different point of view or a point of view that adds on to something else that has you know what i'm saying we all have a valid voice in this game so it's not that you know we have to fight for the same space mm -hmm. we all have our lane we have all created our lane like you said, back in the days, back in 2006, 2007, when before podcasting was even heard of, it was Sweat Radio. Mm -hmm. Sweat Radio, we had the call-in show. Sweat Radio had our own lane of people call, you know, calling in, whatever topic we were, we were discussing, we would talk about it, and we would, have a, we, you know, we would have a catharsis. We would have a resolution. We had something to say. You know what I'm saying? Sure, nobody, you know what I'm saying, um... You know, there was a, a limited view of how it was heard, but still we had something to say. Mm -hmm. Now that we're on YouTube, we have we have um, the potential to reach a wider audience so that our voice can be heard potentially. But that's not invalid because, you know what I'm saying, um, what's his name, Nori has, is saying this, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, or Dame Dash is saying that, or P. Diddy is saying this, you know what I'm saying. Our voice is valid because of, you know what I'm saying, the thoughts that we have, the experiences that we had, the way we view life, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And I think that's what the key is. Mm -hmm. That's what the thing that makes us special, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? This is, what, this is how we reach wider audiences because we're giving them something that doesn't get publicized, that doesn't get so, thrown in the, you know what I'm saying, so gets, saying gets keep, thrown in their face, so you, you know what I'm saying? keep pressing forward. Keep pressing forward and everything because we got a different perspective. The main thing, the wait, the main thing is yes, but the main thing is is that our voice is just as valid. It might not be known, but that's just a matter of time. That's just a matter of thing because whoever, you know, what I'm saying, you never know. Tomorrow we might blow up. Mm -hmm. You know, what I'm saying we might be more popular than Jay. We might be more popular than than mm -hmm. Dame or Nori or, or Joe Rogan or whoever. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So that's just a matter of how well, how the trends go. I'm gonna tell you, in this shit because it's like, hell we, yeah, we absolutely. They got to do with two women and they on the outside. I'm sandwiched. <laughs> well, look, thank I'm you. a man cream sandwich. Man, man, man cream. No, fair no, enough. Because I see a I see a spot. <laughs> not man cream sandwich. Look, check the radio news. You know what I'm saying? When we started, we started on a different platform. We started on a platform of we have. Uh, a radio style format, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, sure, we took liberties and we still had a call in function. You would call in, you know what I'm saying? Whatever we're talking about, they add to the conversation, you know what I'm saying? And you know what I mean? We would have a back and forth, we would have a dialogue that would mean something more than what the, what the conversation originally started, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And that's what Disturbingly Random is a product of, you know what I'm saying? What is a child of is that. So on its own merits, you know what I'm saying? There is merit here. You know what I'm saying? Even though, you know what I mean, it might not be, but that's just you know what I'm saying. And in time, it'll be it'll be that big. I see it no, as no, being no, that big. No, no, that cookie blew in my ear like 14 times just now. Nate. You listen over there. That's what that's only that's, 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 right. That's only because she, that's 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 only because she, she, she pretending that you mean shit. This should make way too much sense. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? I know that's because you know what I'm saying. She pretending that you mean. You know what I'm saying? And don't worry, cookie. You know what I'm saying? Me and you are gonna have a conversation afterwards. You know what I'm saying? After the mics go off and the. <laughs> Cameras get That's turned down and some more. Yeah, well, well, I, I got a couple of things. A conversation about what? Oh, don't worry. That's for the. You know what I'm saying? That's for the. Okay, that's for you know. That's for the director's cut. Hmm? The last week you said you were with us for you on this right now. Hey, um. Eddie yeah, Murphy gonna be on SNL. Yeah, Eddie Murphy. Thirty-five years. Thirty-five. Yeah, thirty-five years. And they think later that maybe Eddie Murphy gonna do SNL. I heard he's gonna do a lot of his original skits. Oh yeah? I'm gonna be damn it. He need to do that. Hmm. That's funny. 
He needs to do Mr. Robinson's neighborhood. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? That's yeah, my that's favorite joint. That's my most favorite shit. Did you see the Dave Chappelle shit? Yes, I did. There's a lot of offend, shit I laughed at that I shouldn't you? have been laughing at, bro. I'm <laughs> feeling fucking crazy about <laughs> it. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Dog, right? You finished it? But you I get it. He was, he's yeah. a comedian. You're up there. You're doing a job. Yo, Dave and you, you got to say Dave real wild that. shit. But some of the shit, I was just like, man... I don't know. I think I, I, you know what? I, I'm on. cautious of people's feelings and I'm cautious of how people are interpret. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. Yeah. Mm. And, and, yeah. And interpret yeah. what I say wrong and it's not, I don't want it to be interpreted like that. So. He was like, I don't he think funny. he gave a fuck how anybody felt. He wasn't supposed he to. He said that. He don't, no, he that's how that. I want to feel, but I ain't need, I ain't need no, that be like, I mean, yeah. that's how, that's how the first name so of, the, of, of, the, the, of the dude. Oh, 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 say it. Say it. Your mouth got to curl up like that. Hold on, Ro, Ro, that sounds like the dude, the dude's first name in Prometheus. Yeah, it's just a <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. So whether he's talking about, you know, what I'm name? saying the Harold. What name? What was Cookie? How was? How you say Cookie? Cookie. Why are you off like that? No, I'm chill. Like Cookie. Like Hold on, chill. <laughs> Yo, bro. Cookie. Cookie then would would be le Cookie. <laughs> le Cookie. Do it look like it? I'm tired. <laughs> you forgot. I moved my daughter. We had to finish packing that stuff. Who, 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 first of all, first of all, Cookie, with a shirt yeah, like that, yeah. you should never be tired. You should always be on number ten. Why is it? Says bless. Why right? that shirt doing it? And I and I love those lips. Why that shirt going? Why that shirt doing it? Hey man, um, because she in it. Another thing. Let me just add on to this because we gotta get, get the hell up out of here. Um, so we did that. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you see Ashanti IG? Did you have Ashanti? Mm-hmm. I, Ashanti got some thick ass legs and I like that. Ashanti oh, look good. Got some thick thighs. For it. it. Somebody, I don't know. It can't gotta be nothing. Ashanti be over in Dubai messing with them sheets. Them dudes will be selling oil on me. Yeah, she's definitely got a billionaire buying her shit. Somebody's gonna put a leash on her and walk her through the desert. Huh? Yeah. You wanna go to Dubai and put a leash on your neck and walk in the sand? I'm not gonna put your knee if you got to. I'm not gonna have nobody with no leash on my neck. That's what they do over there. How you know? You been? I heard. If you ain't been, you can't talk about it. Yo, Cookie, don't say what you want to do. When you go there, when you, yeah, and then you, I only gonna see you one way, because when you get there, you're gonna get a leash. You gotta find your way. You're gonna get a leash on your neck, you're gonna get a leash on your neck, and nothing's gonna pee on you, you're gonna walk on your knees. You stupid. You are. It happens. I'm telling you. It's gonna happen. That's right. I got my leash in the car and all that. Where? You Dubai. Dubai? No. Say bird. Yes or no? No. Hey man, Officer, yeah. Officer Panaleo and everything, um, he finally got fired after he uh, choked out Eric, Eric Gardner um, over in the Bronx and everything. So uh, that sucker finally got out. Um, but he was due. But he not got fired everything. for the after for him murdering, murdering him? somebody. After, or um, he got fired for something unrelated to that. Either or. He should have got more than just fired. You know what I mean? Hey, um, I see. Yeah, I'm an evil. I'm an evil. What's that? Yeah. Well, no, Yo, it looks like a firefly. That was a lot like. today. And then I'm emotional, too. I know. I'm going to miss your baby. Like, like a little pump. You're like a little pump in there when she was on. Emptiness. 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 So that clears up why I look like this. No, I am not she high. Can you wake up no. like this? Can you wake up not like this? Pretty like this, beautiful like this. Yes. She well, looks like this. Where you going? Look at this. But no, I, I'm, I'm very tired and I'm really emotional right now because my baby left me. She ain't leave us. I'm sorry, baby. She you went still to got me. What? It's all good. Yeah. Still got who? You still got me. I ain't never had you. Oh, mm. Mm. Yeah. 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 Um, <laughs> hey man, we're about to put the scoreboard. Hey, we about to put the um, put the put a cap on this thing. I here. can't. I just don't have that. Hey man, why are you talking evil? I'm evil. How am I evil? Nobody had hair on my mouth last week. I feel it. Where you been? He was a mask. 
Hey, we about to get up out of here. Hey, did you say that? We about to get up out of here. Live TV. Cut. Um, Try to get episode. <laughs> episode. Trey. And anything, we up out of here. And anything. Yes, who's two, back? Episode three. We got DJ with us again. And anything. Again. Visual. How you say it? Jenan Jean Francois. Stay tuned for episode four. Mm. Mrs. Besson off. Who taught you how to say that name? Like Mrs. That? Who taught me how to say my name? Oh, my mama. And my dad. I'm, I'm sitting here. Every time you sit, I'll be carrying it in my head, but it won't roll off my tongue, right? That's okay. I'll uh, teach DJ you. is better. I don't know. Mrs. Besson off did that. Yes, she did that. <laughs> Mrs. Besson off was my fifth grade teacher, and she looked at the paper. And now, the first day of school, I always know when the teachers get to my name because they always get that constipated <laughs> look on their face. Like, I don't know what the fuck this is. But at least they try. Why? Because they're educators. No, not Mrs. Bessonoff. Mrs. Bessonoff looked at that shit, looked up, looked back down at it, and then looked up again and was like, last name, Jean Francois. First name starts with a D. I'm going to butcher it, so I'm just going to call you DJ. Oh, uh, bitch. No, you do not. Can you roll it? you roll with it? And here I am, the new kid on the block. I don't know no motherfucker in that class. I don't even know Mrs. Vestinoff. I'm already embarrassed, so I'm like, oh, hi, right, no problem. Not wanting her to do that. Then I go home, and I'm sad about it, and my mom was like, oh, so again, that means what's wrong with you? And I'm like, um, Mrs. Bessemore says she's going to call me DJ. And she's like, well, why you let her call you that? That's not the name I gave you. And I'm like, why are you telling me? She didn't know who did it. <laughs> and all we were trying to say was bye until next week. Damn, we You can see I'm harboring some feelings about that. Somebody get oh, me a therapist. Oh, we, uh, try, oh, we were trying to say was we holler. Send her like, information shit. over at the DMs. Okay? She hey, needs man. to unleash <laughs> some things. Well, she hey. don't know how to get a tummy tuck. Matt said you don't need one. Listen to me. <laughs> Listen to Matt. Again. Matt to will me. hopefully be a surprise guest on a yo, later episode. Yo. You guys need to know him. Yo, um, we out. Love you, Matt. We out. Um, <laughs> me too. <laughs> and this, and, and episode three. Yo, AG, man, I appreciate you coming through, homie. Um, yeah, yeah, you know it. You know uh, he's stopped by once nobody, again. You know what I'm saying? Can't nobody run the cameras like I do. Yeah, man. Tony ran a kid. Love you, love you like cook food. Hey, man, we out. Um, thank you. You hey, said that already. We out. Like eight times. Say bye, pussy. Miss Pussy. She did a print. Uh, say bye, Miss <laughs> DJ. Toodaloo. Toodaloo. Y'all yeah, roll. On full set. We do it again, Nathan. Hey, um, thanks for stopping by, Nathan. Yo, thank you for all of them. Shout out to all of the uh, followers. Shout out to all of the um Yeah, thanks for rocking with us. That's really cool. Hey, hey shout out to us. Hey Beautiful um hair salon. Shout out to Better. Better. Dot that's better. Shout out to Shots by Cookie. Um shout out to uh Hey, shout out to my man, um Lyric too. Anything but Yeah, on. you missed it. But you wanna send a car service for me? What is it? Twerk, 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 twerk. You wanna twerk for car service? No, you got to work with Carter. Shout out to shout out to my man Lyric and everything. There's a new single coming out. Um, <laughs> you and me and everything that's coming out. I don't know if it's you and me or you and I, but either way, you guys see the episode how it went down. Um, we're up out of here. But I wish him the best. Again, 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 we're up out of here. Let's do it again next week. Um, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And we're up out of here. Let me give you the remix, baby. Oh.